Oh my god, did y'all see those dodge skills though? Holy shit! Uh... So many of you are probably very familiar with uh, this very basic programming website called Scratch. Now, mainly it was designed for kids to like get into like computer programming and stuff, and it was really helpful. And in today's video, we're gonna be playing like some really cool Scratch games, like these games, like you're just like, I cannot believe this was made in Scratch. And then at the end of it, we're gonna be trying to make a game, so we're gonna be having a lot of fun here. Okay, so this first game I found is called Getting Over It version 1.4. A scratch recreation of Getting Over It by Griff Hatch. So I'm assuming when I play this, this is gonna be exactly like Getting Over It, except free. Ooh, even a menu screen? Commentary? Nah. 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 Ah, whatever. I've never played Getting Over It before because I'm poor and I can't afford it. Okay, what's over here? I know I'm not, I'm not supposed to come this way, but... I died! Let's go! Death speed run! <laughs> Six seconds! Go, go faster. <laughs> I wasn't even doing it! Swinging around like a dumbass. I'm gonna play it normally. Oh, the skill! Oh my god! Hello? What am I doing? God damn, the controls for this game are very complicated. Bro, can I- Can I actually, like, not get stuck, please? What am I supposed to be doing? Okay. Oh my god. Can I get up there? Bro, get up! Uh-oh. I'm gonna be here for a while. I did it, I did it. more intense than starting over. I didn't even hear it for a second. I was so delayed. Oh God! Oh! Oh my God! I'm so good. You see this skill? Oh shit! Oh shit! Is that it? Oh! Yes. Okay. Okay. Shit! Nudge ourselves over here. Uh -huh. Oh! <gasps> oh! Baby, I'm doing so good right now! Shit! Oh! Okay. Huh? You bitch! Bro! Shit! Bro, I just hit his head. God damn. What am I sliding? Mm hmm. Okay. Slowly. <gasps> oh my god. <laughs> There's no way I just did like all of that in one go. Okay, so we're doing a different game. You didn't see that. We next have this game called Boss Fight Simulator by Hanzi. I don't think that's how you say that. This looks pretty cool. Press any key to start. Pretty cool. Okay. Player editor battle credits. Okay, we're gonna battle. Opponent number one. Scroll with left, right. Fight. Okay, we're fighting this guy. Oh, wait. What? What is this? Oh, shit. So. Oh! Okay. Okay, putting the moves on him. Oh shit. Oh shit. Cut 
I'm on the move. This music is so loud. Sorry, I, got, I had to turn the music down. That's so loud. Holy shit. Popping on the moves right now. Ooh. Ooh. Get dodged! The skills, bro. I'm putting moves on this guy. Oh, yeah. Oh. Demolished. Oh, shit. Shit, I'm like trapped. Shit. Oh, God. That was close. Come on. Battle complete! Let's go. We're doing more of that. That's fucking cool. Okay, now opponent two. We got the shadow. Let's see this guy. Oh. Excuse me? How is that fair? How is that fair? Oh. What just happened? Oh, I accidentally pressed E and went to the menu. That's kind of goofy, but... What on earth? Dude, how is this fair? It's gonna take so long. I'm trying to guess where he is. Oh, putting the moves on him. Oh, where is he? Is he here? Legit, where is he at? Oh! Oh, he's right here. He's over here. For sure. Oh, God! Wait, what? Shit, he's gonna be, like, over here. I guess that shit! Every time you see where he goes, he goes to, like, a different corner. Okay, come on. This fight has to be over soon. I'm obviously winning. Oh, oh, yeah. Oh, put the moves on him. You guys see this skill? Oh, oh, yeah. I'm too good at this game, guys. I'm too good at this game. Opponent three, the spike ball. I think there might be like probably five, maybe. There might be more. I don't know. Whoa, what is happening? Going through. Going through. Okay, this boss fight's pretty cool. He's very chill. He's not really doing anything right now. Woo! Okay, hopping off, going around him, going around him. Okay, I think we have him down. I think we're I think he's almost dead. Oh. so easy! Oh, damn! Okay, how many? 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Okay, so there's 12. We're gonna do... We're gonna, we're gonna do 6, so that's half of them. We're gonna do 6. Because this one's called a twin, so I'm assuming he's gonna be pulling off some twin DS. What on earth? What is happening? Popping off, I'm doing some heavy damage on this guy. Crap! I'm okay. Wow, this is loud. Okay. Popping off. He's almost dead. Come on. Oh. Hit him with the skill, bro. I'm just too good. I'm too good. I think I get hit like right at the end there, so it wasn't hitless, which is so fucking dumb. And the last one. Well, this isn't the last one, but it's the last one we're doing. If you guys want me to like do more of these games, like in the future, like comment down below. Like this, this is actually like a pretty cool game. Like holy shit. 
Oh god, I got hit. I got hit. That's fu fuck. Oh god. Move! Where is he even at? Where I can't see him. Yeah, here he is. Oh my god, did y'all see those dodge skills though? Holy shit! Bro, popping off like Corey Kenshin and Al Oni, dude. You ready for them juke skills? Ooh! Ho, ho, Barry Sanders! Fuck. I think I hit the menu. God damn it. I'm good at these games. Oh. Of course I hit E again. No! <laughs> I went to the menu again! Oh my god. Shit, where is he? I hit E again. Oh, oh. We're here? Yeah, oh, 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 oh. Oh, God. We have him super low, okay? We have him pretty low. He's got hit with like a barrage. We're here? We're here. Come on. He's almost dead. He's almost dead. Let's go. Hit list two. Oh, my God. I literally accidentally backed out of that fight like seven times. It was so dumb. Alright, this last game we have is called Crystal Seeker 3D Platformer. I don't get how on earth you could get a 3D platformer in Scratch, but we're gonna see how this turns out. Uh, we're gonna say slow, just so it can run a little bit better. New game. Okay, good, bad. Click to proceed. Bad stole. Find all. Okay, I'm just ready. No way. How on... Okay, it's really laggy, though. It's really... it's. I, I'm, I was assuming it was going to be laggy because it's a fucking 3D platformer. What? Oh, God, bro. Okay, I got a coin. It's so cool, though. That is so interesting. Jump on top of jump on top of to vanquish it. Okay. Damn. Oh. Wow. Okay. You got some nerve, bitch. Let's go. Space to jump. Oh, hello. Uh. Uh. Oh yeah. Oh shit! I am not making that. I don't even go. Well. I don't. Okay. Fuck. Shit, run. Okay, but guys, you y'all have to admit this is really cool though. Oh fuck. Uh that that is so cool. That is so cool. There's like how on earth do you get a 3D platformer in like a 2D programming thing? Like how how did they do that? Okay, yes, I know I'm wearing a different shirt. I filmed that whole first half four days ago. It took me a while to edit it. And I'm not going to wear the same shirt four days in a row, because that's just gross. Three days is the limit. But yes, welcome to the section of the video where we try to make our own game, okay? You got that? That's what we're doing? Okay, just catching you up. Okay, so I just made a new Scratch project. This is just what it starts you off with. It starts you off with the sprite and nothing else. This is not the sprite we're using. We are going to make our own. Let's go in and we are going to draw our lovely, lovely sprite. We're going to work on his head. This is his head. Here are his eyes. Here's his mouth. He just looks like a guy with a really great jawline. Now we're going to work on his hair. So he's going to have brown hair. Okay, now that we have his hair, it just looks like someone took a large diarrhea shit on top of his head. Good enough. Boom. There we go. Red, so I guess he can have lips. And now he's just gonna have soulless black eyes. Bam, bam. Fantastic. Yep, he looks great. Now to give him some ugly pants, we're gonna make them bright green. And we're just gonna give him really short legs, because why not? <laughs> so fucking ugly. <coughs> Alright, this is our character. We're gonna change his size a little bit. There we go. That's still a little bit too big. We're gonna... Bam. That's a little bit too small. There. Boom. Uh, let's come up with a name for him. Tim bob a -thi. Tim bob -a -thi. The third. His full name will be Joseph Tim bob -a -thi scrappy Doo the third. Joseph Tim bob -a -thi 
Scrappy Doo the third. Wonderful name for someone who has no neck, hands, or feet. We're gonna make it so that when you press the up arrow, he will go up. But problem, he cannot come back down. So he's currently stuck in the ceiling, you know, Jumanji style. When down arrow key press, he will go negative. So now, he can go both ways. I don't like using the arrow keys, so we're just gonna make it WASD. And now, just have to do the other two directions. So now he can jitter about the screen and do literally nothing else. So let's give him something to do. Now we're going to create a second sprite. This one is going to be an evil green goblin. There, that looks goblin-y enough. Now we're going to give him his horns. Those just look like ears. I'm bad at drawing, hold on. Those are horns. So we're going to give him his awfully obese body with his awfully skinny limbs and give him a soulless black belly button and now we're gonna give him red eyes so the name of this is evil goblin creature ew gross get it away from me now we're gonna have to make sounds we're gonna search this sound library perfect now we can also mess with it Okay, anyway, we're gonna call this shark. Weird, buddy. You're weird. When space key pressed, start this sound. So what we're gonna do, select him. We're gonna create another one, and then kaboom. We're just gonna change something small. We're gonna make it so his one arm throws the things. So now he's gonna throw the thing. That is not what his arm's supposed to look like. He's gonna throw the thing. Arms don't bend like that, but it's better than what we had before. There, now it's gonna do that. And then switch costume to costume two. Wait zero seconds. We're gonna switch it back to the first costume. Make a variable for this sprite only. Fuse. Change. Fuse by one. And now we're gonna really quick make it so that whenever you start the game, it'll start you at zero, and then you just kinda go up from there. Oh god. You can just hold down space. Convertible. There we go. Okay, when this is clicked, hide. When space key press, show glide to evil goblin creature. Ew, gross, get it away from me. If touching goblin creature, hide, glide to. So basically now, whenever I press space... Anyway, we're gonna start the game, and... We are gonna really quick make a sound. <laughs> oh my god. That's perfect. Goblin. Screech. Ah. When space key pressed, start sound. Goblin screech. Ah. Anyway, we're gonna need to create another costume for the goblin. Copy and paste. Nuke. Bam. Okay. Now what we're gonna do is we're gonna put blood all over him. There's gonna be blood everywhere. There. Boom. Switch costume to costume two. Wait zero seconds. Switch costume to costume one. So now we have this. Okay, I think this is pretty much the game here, so... Yep, I know exactly what you're thinking right now. Jack, why are you wearing a different shirt? So that part you just watched there, you know how in the beginning I explained how I filmed the original, like, first part, like, four days ago? Yeah, I also filmed that last part you just saw three days ago. Look, I'm sorry. I have a really bad computer. I've still been a little bit sick, and I've also just not been in the mood to edit. More videos will be coming out, and I will try my best to be more consistent. But yeah, this video was pretty fun to record, not edit. It was not fun at all to edit. It was actually soul-sucking. Just like those eyes. Those dark, soulless, black eyes. 
No emotion. No thought. They frighten me. I just can't bear to look at them. Well, uh, that was weird. Anyway, subscribe, and I will see you in the next one.